Hey, it's cool here. If you don't know, and it is time for some more of the extra long run where we are playing Kirby and the Forgotten Land. Currently up to 65%, and uh, still got a bit to go here, so let's get going. Laureline is in town. You think we should um check in with her maybe? We probably should, Alphalin. Um so I guess a little bit of a catch up here. Um I spent a bunch of time fishing. And as a result you can see my money up there in the top right is now at five thousand one hundred and nine. And my best catch is this heckin' chonker. But, um, yeah, turns out that, um, fishing is indeed a very good way to, um, to amass money in this game. Anyway, um, so the first thing that we're going to do today is go check on Claroline. Is this another mysterious vortex? What? You said it's Leonkar somewhere in there? Uh-oh. Well, things are happening, that's for sure. Oh dear, what is this? Oh my gosh! This feeling! This is exactly how it felt when I was absorbed by my other half, Vectu Elphilus. It's possible that after that big battle, Leongar became trapped in a strange place. Come on, Kirby. We have to check it out. So I guess we have one more world to go. Isolated Isles, Fargo Dreams. But we're not going to be revisiting anything quite yet. This place, it, may, it feels like it's made from strong psychic energy. Let's be careful. Uh, are there any treasure rifts, though, is my question. Doesn't look like it. Four, five, six. Well, it looks like six stages here and a uh, boss, so still got some work to do, apparently. Oh, what's this? We're also not looking for hidden Ds, but we're looking for hidden Vs. This looks vaguely like the beginning of, like, Crash Bandicoot. Also, the beginning of this game. So what's this? You got a piece of Leon's soul? Wait, is this Leon Gar's soul? It must be a tiny fragment of it. If you collect more of these scattered soul pieces, you might be able to save him. Try to collect more pieces of Leon's soul as you explore the isolated isles of Forgo Dreams. Interesting. Alright. Like anything over there? No. Okay.
I see you there. Don't think you can hide. Okay, so it's only going to stop gameplay for animation the first time. I feel like there's probably something in here. Hmm. There's some way that we can cut this uh this grass. Oh. There's another one. Yeah, it's really shoving um Mostly hammer on us here. Oh. Game did not like me doing that, apparently. I don't think I've seen any cutting abilities so far. Either that or I haven't been paying attention, one of the two. I'll try to kick it onto the... No. Well, that is where one of these uh, star shards is. Oh, look at that. There is the last one. So that's going to reveal, ooh, three solar shards. So enemies can also be can also contain soul uh soul shards. That is good to know. Hmm. Button down there. Being nice and creative where with where they put these. Yeah, I thought so. Hmm. I'm gonna hold on to this. Oh dear. Aha. I oh, guess it's right back to hammer here. 
And it the, the game is very nice in that even if you completely destroy the mini boss, looks like you've already collected all the pieces of the on soul in this spot. Let's check the next area. Oh, nice. It's actually telling me. But yeah, it's nice in that, like, if you, um, if you completely destroy a mini boss, uh, in most of the previous games, that would mean you don't get that ability. If, like, even if you wanted it or needed it, that's too bad. But, um, in this game, at the very least, yeah, oh, it you destroy the uh, you destroy the mini boss. No, you still get the ability. Why shouldn't you? Hmm. Interesting. So does it want me to have cluster needle, I wonder? Because I can't break these. What's up here? Okay, this is what you want me to do. Lots of ambushes. I feel like there's a uh, a high price on Leongar's soul here. There's a lot of these I'm collecting. I'm met with ambush. Ah, gotcha. This is required to break that. Let's see if I can break all of it, because there you never know when there's gonna be some sort of special prize for fully clearing something out. There we go. And that's all. Excellent. Oh geez. I I saw that coin over there. I was like, kinda want that coin, but then uh I took a step too far and there that is. area. Now. There we go. Now what we got here? You're gonna be a big friendly buddy. My big friendly buddy, I mean, uh, try to kill me. Hmm. 
Get out of there. There we go. Oh, this looks, uh, this looks entirely unpleasant. And, and that's why. Secret spot here. Yeah, game has definitely taken off the kitty gloves at this point, which it usually does when it, uh, when it, when you get far enough. Not for that. Ah, and that was for a Maxim Tomato. Well, that's not too bad. I was hoping for a Soul Shara, but you know. Let's see if I can get up there. Is there anything up there? Can't get up there. Gotcha. All right. Get out of my way. Ah! God dang it, Bobby. Ah, uh, boy, ain't right. There we go. That was that was actually kind of rough. Not gonna lie. Oh, secret spot. Secret spot. There we go. Oh no. What's about to happen here? Oh dear. All right. And those do indeed go away, so uh I see you there. Don't think I don't. Oh, please don't interrupt me here, Alpha Lynn. <laughs> all right, so I got all of the soul in this area. Give me one second here, and there we go. It's not how an uh, automated platform works. Yeah. It's also not how an, an automated platform works. You don't usually have to dodge things when you're on one of those game. Now, I want to try to collect all the coins because sometimes collecting all the coins actually results in something. Oh, you're excited. No, I got it. 
took a hit, but I got it. Now you got to be super observant for, for some of these. That's so far so good, though. Go ahead and switch to dragon fire. Ah. Let's go ahead and switch to getting hit. I need to not jump over these. There we go. That's four. And the last one is over here. Five. So we're going to open that up. Yep. There we go. And that's the last one. Well, for this area, anyway. It's a big area. Like a big stage. I think I want to hold on to this for as long as I can. Hmm. Aha! That's how I get you. Oh, geez. Gotta be sure not to slam down on places where... Okay. Yeah, there's one down there. I see it. Oh, this is massively unpleasant. Okay, there we go. Um, let's put this down for a second so that I can get this. Oh, that was close. Hmm. All right. Yep, that was going to happen. What's this? Oh, is that a verse? Yeah, that's just straight up a rare stone. Okay. Just sitting out in the open, I guess. Yeah, I figured there was one down here. And in fact, there were three down here, and they were the last three. Get rid of it. Let's bring Floor Tornado to the next place, shall we? Hmm, or not, let's uh, hammer it up. Hmm. 
Not sure what the point of that warp star was. Phantom Gormondo. Ah, stop doing that. Dang. It may be hammer was not the way to go. Ow. Like the the big problem with this ability is that it is uh effectively a uh short range ability which means you got to get up into him basically Ow. Oh, you got to be spinning. I'm going to go ahead and use my uh my energy drink honestly. Because we're not doing so well, but uh, we are we are also making a fair, you know, decent amount of progress here against Garmondo. So Well, kind of asked for that one, honestly. There we go. That was incredibly messy, and I had absolutely no right to have won that fight, but you know, that's what happened anyway. So what I'm getting from that is that um, each stage of this is going to basically be like an entire level in review. We managed to get all of the uh, soul pieces out of that, so we're off to a good start. On to Forgo Bay. So I'm, yes, I know. So I'm guessing that um, in order to have this area like finished, uh, you have to fill in to where that little kind of cutoff is at about 
10 o'clock. Forty-eight soul uh, soul pieces in Fargo Bay. Let's go. It's kind of an, inter an interesting change of pace to not have uh, not have to worry about um, well I did that wrong. Try that again. That was right at the beginning of the stage. Hey, Tyrion. Welcome to this game's equivalent of this game's equivalent of Meta Knight Ultra, DDD Tour, and so on. Yeah, the, I can I can see that. Yeah. I'm not sure why it's an equivalent of an equivalent, but uh, I'll trust your math on that. I didn't notice you wrote it twice. Gotcha. And we've already established these shadow guys will always have a uh, soul piece to them. Also, I just realized, yeah, I was in Gloopy McGloop there. There we go. Can I? Yes, I can. All right. Dang. Okay. This is a very good ability for this fight. There we go. Kirby in the not remembered place. Yes, indeed, Hyven. Hope you're doing well tonight. I very much appreciate that Ashley tells you that, yes, this is everything here. It's a very polite mode, yes. I was worried there for a second that I had fallen into nothing, despite the fact that there is definitely water here. That's a lot of ability swapping. No real reason for it, honestly. Get out of here. Well, I just destroyed something over there, probably. Well, this tells you how many pieces are in an area if you enter again after missing. That's really cool. 
It is cool of it to not tell you the first time so that you can try to, like, uh, I guess, one CC it in a sense. Yeah, check for those secret spots. Oh, there's a target over there. Let's casually obliterate the target. I see you. It's a polite mode, but some of the placements are kind of rude. It's like, yeah, that looks that looks like it would fit perfectly well into the scenery, but actually no, it's a it's a soul piece. It's probably easier to one CC this than the main stages. Yeah, I, I would kinda hope so, because uh Like the the main stages will just straight up not tell you what you need to be doing. Whereas here is just like, yeah, there's a bunch of soul pieces that are hidden. That's literally all you need to do. And also there's the occasional rare stone. That is a very strong barricade. Ah. Ow. Ooh. Well, <clears throat> I need to find some health here. I'm almost out of my extra bar of health. And spitting fire in the wrong direction is not going to help me survive. Also being greedy. Come on. Where is that coin in relation to myself? Oh, this is this is a platform. That's what's going on. Ow. All right, checkpoint achieved. There's a secret spot right there. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah. And those are the last ones. That's that just makes me super nervous.
Oh. Oh, my goat. Now. I want ice. Ice is nice. Okay. Thank you. Anything over here? Now there, there's like a breeze that's also going on there that's not letting me go over there. So I'm going to hope that there is indeed nothing over there. Oh, this looks unpleasant. Pet brew, though, that's not nothing. Switch there. One of the series, apparently. And I think underneath that platform, yeah, is a threefer. All right. I gotta worry about that coin, honestly. Yeah, man. There we go. Oh, what is with all these whirlpools? You cannot tell me that was the only thing here. Yeah, sure enough, but in here, which leads to. Oh, that was the last one. Excellent. And as we've seen at the beginning of this stage, those absolutely will drain down the uh, the whirlpool, and then you will not be able to collect them. examining my surroundings. Actually running against the wind here, for the most part. Oh, geez. Oh, that's bad. That's very bad. Uh, how do I get up there? It's pro probably too late at this point, honestly. Oh, maybe not. Aha, you see, this is not being affected by the wind. Like, not in the slightest. That gives me this. Which I will use on that. I get this. Excellent. Oh, this is stressful.
Oh, it looks like I'm not the only the only person who had the idea to play this game tonight. Excellent. Uh Okay, I think I straight up just need to jettison this. So now that that's open... Oh, and I can retry this. Excellent. Oh, I missed one. Let's see if it's not here somewhere, but... If it's not, that's going to be the first one we've missed. Sometimes it's just collecting all the coins. In this case, no. It does seem like... Oh, there it is. So I didn't actually miss one. Those are right here. So now we're five away, and those are going to be on the boss. So that's another one that we have cleared off on the first go. Ah, man, I, I did run out of my other uh, health bar. And there's a max on tomato here, just to add insult to injury. Uh, so our for, so first one wins. Are we gonna use Meta Knight Sword, Chain Bomb, or Pencil Drill? Now that there's actually people in the chat, I can ask. I think Meta Knight Sword is the only level 3 ability that we have out of these three. Give it like another 20 seconds or so. And that's 20 seconds. All right, sword it is. Phantom Tropic Woods, Illusory Fronds. Ow. Oh, what are you doing? It's a good thing that uh, it can't, like, swallow us. At least not in this phase. I don't know about the next phase. Ow. Also, though, that cheek puff looks very, like, mainframe-esque, if I'm going to be honest. Which isn't necessarily a bad thing, it's just, like, it feels a little out of place. Oh, what is this? Now I have to figure out a labyrinth of doom in order to damage 
Phantom Tropic Woods here. Whoosh. I say no, sir. Interesting that that route never actually left. I guess I have to kind of destroy it. Yeah, there we go. And there we go. That went a lot smoother than Gormando. And we have defeated Not Wispy Woods and gotten all of the soul pieces in Forgo Bay. Getting to the root of the problem, Blaze, hey. Haven't seen you around my, around my stream in a while. How you doing? Now on to Forgo Park. Massive headache. Oh dear. <laughs> Kirby causing deforestation everywhere they go. So 51 soul pieces in Fargo Park. Also, we didn't see any um, rare stones in that last stage. I imagine there's probably one somewhere, it's just where. Also, before I continue, we get to use it one, once a day. I'm going to do it. There we go. My one single amiibo that I own. <laughs> Not really a fan of the fact that there seems to be like one song for all of these uh, four go stages. Okay, so I cannot destroy that. Ow. Kind of almost want to just take the death, honestly. Rather than use the, uh, the energy drink this early in the stage. You know what? Take me. Dead. Second death in the game. Lost a hundred coins. That's perfectly fine. Now. But uh, yeah, I'm doing all right. It's always a good day when you're playing the Kirby's. Except some of the like post game stuff for uh, a couple of the games. Also, good to know that I did not get to keep the um I did not get to keep the soul pieces that I had collected up to that point. Hmm. There we go.
And yes, indeed, I am definitely going to need this right here. Out. There we go. It is kind of interesting that some of these are just kind of um, blocked out of view rather than being actually locked behind something or someone. Right, this thing. There we go. Can I do anything in there? No. Can I do anything in here? No. All right. So it's just a matter of getting up. There we go. Hmm. I am not sure what you want of of me here, game. Oh wait, there's a secret spot. Yeah, there we go. Ah. Uh, yeah, I knew that was going to happen. Uh there there is a there is a difference here. We're uh we're specifically looking for Leon Gar's soul. What with being Kirby, we don't actually have a soul. At least that's what I figure. It doesn't mean Kirby doesn't know compassion, but uh, now, oh geez. You're getting excited. Uh-oh. Oh, mama. Okay. Yeah, Frosty is, uh... Frosty's a little hyper right now. You need a timeout. Stay frosty, buddy. Anything over here? Oh, oh, okay. So it gave us a uh, an, ab an ability pedestal with ice on it. But definitely, like, 100% wants us to have ice right now. Hmm. Oh. It's over here. I can get into there. There we go. Secret spot. Ooh. There we go. And that will give us hopefully the last three.
No. Hmm. Oh, there is one over there. I figured that this wasn't here for no reason. And sure enough, that was the last one. Man, we're doing really good on these so far. Ah, jerk. Ah. Now I'm going to say this, usually haunted houses are not act are not actively trying to kill you and I know I made this remark. Um oh jeez. I know I made this remark when I did the haunted house level uh in the start of the game, but you know. Worth mentioning again here. A capsule, interesting. That's also something that we have not seen um, at least so far in the context of uh, this final world. There we go. Oh. That's what you're going to do. All right. Well. <laughs> oh, that seems like the way forward. Oh, geez. Now, how was I supposed to avoid that? Usually haunted houses are closed during a post-apocalypse. I mean, yeah, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. Okay. This is how I was supposed to avoid that. There's a friend there. Some health back. Aha. Now these are totally going to retract. Yeah. In this one, I'm going to guess that one of those uh, charging buffalo, buffalo, buffalo probably had one. So, oh well, we had a good run up until that point.
Oh, geez. Get it. All right. Definitely still want me to have ice. This one's going a little faster. And I think we might have lost this race. Yep. Sure did. Hmm. Right, there's one down there. And there's a rare stone that I'm completely going to miss. Fortunately, it doesn't appear to be going anywhere. There we go. Get the thing. There we go. Hmm. And up here to get three more soul pieces. There's one more. I think that's about it for actually no that oh right, because we, we did miss one. Like we know we've missed one, so we're not going to get the notification for here, unfortunately. Yeah, obviously. And you're not going away, are you? Yeah, no, you're not. The maze of frightening annoyances. Very strange to be playing a Kirby game from, like, straight up a top-down perspective. Hey, that opens that up. And that also gives us a warp star out of here. Or else we'd be a fool to take that right away. Oh wait, you came back. Which means I need bomb. I'm not sure for what yet, but I need it. And we've already been that way. Oh, okay. I see now. There we go. Okay, 
where is one more? It's probably one more somewhere. Oh, here we go. There we go. All right. Everywhere, everywhere we go, go. Oh, thank goodness. All right. Uh, so first one wins uh, Chain Bomb, uh, Meta Knight Sword, or Crystal Needle. And it looks like we're going up against Phantom Claroline. Any any takers? Another twenty seconds. Sword it is. Oh, Blaze, I was asking which ability should I use for this boss fight? And then I'm going to immediately lose it, like on first contact with the very first thing that hits me. Now, yeah, unfortunately, the one that explodes is gone now. That's one that I brought in with me, so that's not even going to be an option if I have to retry this boss, which at the current rate, probably. All right. Oh, there are four of you. Okay. Oh, and you immediately recover. Oh, and you do the, the thing that Leongar did. These bosses are not joking around. And like 100%, there's going to be a mode in the Coliseum where I'm going to have to fight all of them with very limited supplies. Oh my goodness. Can you please not? Not gonna be like Fi saying I'm discounting on you. Well, I guess you weren't there for for that uh, 
for that game. Which, by the way, I'm discounting on you is uh, one of the emotes that I want to uh, to eventually add. So how many did I get? 49? Please tell me 49. 46! Oh my, I missed a few, didn't I? Oh. Big Rig Mouth Kirby. To save two worlds, Kirby's final mouthful must be his biggest. It looks a lot uh it looks like a lot to handle, but he seems totally fine somehow. Go, Kirby. Carry your and Elflin's combined hope for the future. Race through the sky and deliver the final blow. Only five what? Let's see. I, I wonder about one thing here. So we didn't find... That one has a purple middle in it. That one uh, is full. Now the purple middle just means that we found all of the uh, soul pieces. Um, let's go back to Waddle D Town. But there is a present code hidden somewhere in town. And we get all of the, uh, I haven't missed any blueprints. All right. Well, I hope you feel better, Blaze. Thanks for dropping by. Um, so yeah, since I did pick up a bunch of money, we can probably afford to upgrade like a couple of these. So they are all on the table, but I will point out that um, King DDD's hammer, and for some reason, Deep sleep are more expensive. So we can probably afford any two of these, uh, any three of these four, or one of these four in hammer. And it looks like Tyrion is saying deep sleep. Let's go ahead and take a nap. Oh, you were joking about the name. Oh, well. It's too, that's unfortunate, but... Uh, I've noticed we're not falling asleep yet. Well, that's our health back. Oh, that's our health back and then some. So that was actually a pretty good decision, honestly. So we can afford two of these three or one or um hammer heals you fully and gives you a random buff very nice we need to survive the whole cycle for the buff gotcha So we got uh, Pencil Drill, 
that we can upgrade into Twin Drill. Uh, we got Storm Tornado. We got Homing Bomb. And the Mast Hammer. If you're fast, if you're fast enough, you can do the whole cycle before your drop item vanishes. Nice. Uh, just uh, in order to clear out as many of these as possible, I think I'm going to go ahead and select two of these. Bomb ability has evolved into homing bomb. Oh, that's that's neat. <laughs> you do seem to lose the uh, the chain part of uh, of the bomb. But uh, homing bomb is kind of neat. Uh, and then I'm going to take drill. It takes us down to zero um, rare stones. Oh, you do keep the chain bit. I miss that. It's hard to pull off on the bombs. Yeah. Twin drill. That just kind of goes off into uh into wherever, doesn't it? Oh, some pretty good damage actually. All right. Um Probably afford to buy another energy drink here. Oh, we did indeed run out of stars. But not to worry, I'm sure there's plenty more where those came from. Also, sound test. Something that I found out a um, couple days ago. These guys. Um, okay, you don't actually see it, but... Uh, Is there someone I can actually talk to? There we go. Elflin tells us. Wow, they built a corner stage. Looks like that band is named the Deedly Dees. <laughs> Amazing. Can we stop and listen? Maybe they'll play requests if we top if we toss star coins into their guitar case. I kind of don't want to, like, spend all of my, like, I don't want to fill this up immediately, but, uh, sorry we disappeared on you, Claroline. The space through that tiny vortex is so weird. 
It's made from su powerful psychic energy. I think I've been in that place before. It felt just like getting absorbed by my other half. Neongar must be stuck in that mysterious space somewhere. We'll keep looking for him in there, okay? Just hold on a bit longer. All right, on we go. But yeah, I found that out while um, while I was preparing my radio show, because um, I ended up playing the uh, the intro song to this game. Welcome to the New World. Um, for that show, and um, yeah, found out that the the house band here is called the Deedly Dees. Just amazing. Forgo horns. I'm coming in with a pair of horns. Let's go. Oh, it looks like we're coming in with exactly the right ability right off the bat. Hmm. Maybe if... Yeah, I'm trying to do that game. I keep getting stuck on the geometry. There we go. Is there one in there too? Yeah, there was. Good thing I got it. Huh, all right. Aha! Let's see. Make sure I'm not missing anything here. Not sure if that was for killing all of them in one blow, if it was for just getting all of them. Taking a little nappy nap. That's what I think of you. Okay. And one over there. I guess this is ice. Yeah, it sure is. Secret spot. Lead to more soul. Thank you. I just realized, oh, you only get one. Or maybe like two. 
But I definitely needed that, didn't I? I'm going to hold on to it for now, just in case there's something I can do with this. But no, the answer is no, I needed it. I needed it for over there. And I go back around the long way and then break that. Think it respawns? You can go check. It does respawn, but does it respawn with ammo? Yes, it does. Three of them exactly. At least this time we know. All right. And even one to spare, even after wasting one. Yikes. Are you here wearing a, a Mickey Mouse hat? Hmm. Now that's interesting. I don't remember seeing a fire ability. Huh? Keep an eye out anyway. Also keep one of these guys alive just in case. Oh boy. Ow. Well, I guess that's that then. Oh my goodness, there's wind. What is this? Mario 2J. Oh, geez. Maybe there's one there. Well, there's some fire there, but it's kind of too late now, isn't it? Dang. Yikes. Okay. Here we go. 
Now how do I get those broken? Aha! Mouthful mode to the rescue! I mean, this would have been the big hinge right here. Dang. That is like a very precise movement you need to make here. What, what even? What do you want me to do? Well, definitely not that. There we go. That was for three, so it's not too bad, but that was a lot of health loss. And that's not helping. Oh my goodness, I'm just sabotaging myself now. It does seem like I needed this for here, though. I need to, like... You can do it! Yeah, all right. Hmm. I guess I should probably just go ahead and use this, unfortunately. I am good at video game. Hmm. Oh, secret spot. Okay, then. Now I've got your power. Immediately starting with a couple of these big ones. And you're gonna double. Okay, so you can completely deflect that. Good to know. Oh, we're not done. Probably as evidenced by the fact that the music hadn't stopped playing. Almost got there, but not quite. Ow, 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 ow.
spin to win. Who's got the most powerful spin? Why, I do believe that was Kirby. Okay, well, let's keep this going, apparently. Are we just fighting all of the mini-bosses? Is that what's happening? Oh, what's this? Has one of them been showing up every fight? Because that's the fourth one. Like, that's the first one I've noticed, but that was the fourth one, like, on the list. I'm gonna guess that there has been one every single time. And that's the fifth one, and they all disappeared because I didn't have all of them. Well, so much for any of that. Some ice cream over there. Aha! A little bit more control now over where we're going. Oh, this is interesting. All right. Well, I missed that uh, that health up. Oh, geez, that ain't good. Missing the health up is one thing. Missing the soul piece, that's another entirely. Well, I got it. Dang. Other way. I think we just missed that one. Like, that's dumb. All right. This mode might be polite, but that doesn't mean it's nice. Anything back here? Nope. Boss time! So we've got dragon fire, we've got crystal ice, and we've got uh, whatever cutter. I forget the exact name. I'm just going to say like 20 seconds right off the bat. And it's not way too long here, starting now. I 
fire, ice, or cutter. Disc. Buzzsaw cutter. I will take that as. It's like we're playing against DDD. His illusory nemesis, Phantom King DDD. I'm not sure how that entirely missed me. Excited boy. I think that was only a level two, actually. Aha. Oh, geez. It's going to throw Gordo bars at us. Oh, that turned into ice. DDD here showing us what it means to be a pillar of the community. There we go. Yeah, I'm just going to sit here for a second. Let this song play a little bit. It's okay, it was just a ghost. It was an actual King DDD. It was just a figment of someone's imagination. So out of 51, we got 43. Wow. Less than I thought. Although I don't believe that we found a rare stone in that stage, which is unfortunate. All right, so we got one and two stages before we go on oops, to the finale here. Also, we ended up back at the beginning here for some reason. So next up, therefore, will be Forgo Wasteland. But we will forego going there for a second because it is indeed time for break. So, um, 
Yeah. We will get back to this game in just a bit. For now, just take a moment. Uh, get yourself something to drink, go to the bathroom, stretch your arms, stretch your legs, stretch your teeth. And then when we get back, we will continue with this uh, isolated wasteland of a dreamscape. So, I'll see you in a bit.